So could you tell me more about kind of like your brain fog? Uh, have you seen improvements overall in your health? Uh, what have you noticed? Yeah, I mean, I definitely have a lot more energy. I would say like my anxiety um, is like, you know, pretty minimal. The only thing that like I really, really want to work towards is because I'm still on like all my anti-anxiety meds and stuff like that. And I'm just scared right now to come off of them um, just because I'm feeling good and I'm like, and I do feel like the food is helping me because I really don't have like that tingling stuff going on. Um, the only thing that I still have is like this little like lymph node. It's still is um, still there and like sore. If your body is finding something, some kind of a bug, that's what the lymph nodes can get swollen. If there's some kind of inflammation, they're dividing for whatever reason. That's uh, the the T cells, right? The lymphocytes and the yeah. the antibodies. That's what they go in there and start dividing, and that's why it gets bigger. Because usually lymph nodes get swollen in the area that infection can can be, so it gets mm -hmm. to the closest lymph node, and they make sure that your cells function the best way possible. That including help you fight any viruses or infection that may be in the body. Yeah, and it's so funny because I um I remember it was like early on in the program, like I had that really weird stomach virus and all like so many people in my family got it because I had been eating better and my immune system was probably hopefully a little bit better. I just didn't have as worse of symptoms. My skin, it's probably like the best it's ever been. Like I don't barely, I barely have like any texture, like any pimples. Yeah, my skin has definitely improved for sure. So overall, I'm just really thankful. Like I, because you know, in the beginning when you're feeling like crap and you're just like searching for answers and you're just like willing to do anything and you're just like desperate. And that's how I felt. And then I guess like Jesus was just like, hey, December is not the right month for you to do it. So you just need to wait until January or yeah, January. So anyways, I think it all worked out and I have been feeling like so much better at work. Like I feel like I can um, do more stuff at work. I don't get as stressed out. Like I feel so much more productive. I mean, I'm able to like, you know, take care of my son and like enjoy him more. Like I'm very thankful for everything that you guys have taught me. So just focus on what you know and, and, uh, and that's all. So I know it's, and I think that like I, um, like, cause I follow medical medium and like, he was like live. And then I was like, no, don't watch him. Like, just stick to like, what stick to the plan. Like it's been working for you. Like, so yeah, I really am just like putting on my blinders and just being like, what did the girls tell me? Just stick to it. Cause you've been feeling good. Like, don't go, you know, don't go crazy. I'm going to miss you guys. You're going to miss you too. It's been so nice working with you. I know. I want to see you on The Bachelor. I keep saying it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Brittany. And we're going to be praying for you and your mom and your aunt. I hope they, they get better. And uh, I'll send you, you know, more information and say hi to your family from us. And please continue taking care of, your, of yourself, okay? Okay. All right. I love you, girls. I'll, we love um, you, too. I'll, uh, you too. I'll message you soon or send you a picture of Nolan. One of the two. Uh -huh. Absolutely. Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.